in the right church, but in the wrong pew. As is the pew, so is the pulpit, a square peg in a round hole. That is how born and raised Russian speaker does feel while producing English sounds. We simply have no idea about the dissimilitudes between such sounds as e as well as e. For example, instead of saying friendship, we say friendship. Instead of still living, we say stay living. Instead of sleep, sleep. As a result, we sound this way. You think this bad neighborhood? <laughs> of place when we are supposed to say the p person, the person instead of that person like we do say, me pi instead of meet pi, or for example assimilation of manner, the s side instead of that side is totally Greek to us. Thus, today's lesson is targeted towards reducing Russian accent while producing English speech. First and foremost, palatalization. Palatalization takes place in a casual conversation when a word ends with such sounds as t, d, s, or z. And these words come before words which commence with y sound. Take, for example, the following word gratuitous. Gratuitous. Have you ever thought we do not say? gratuitous or take for example soldier soldier education education we do not say education in the phrase what did you say the word did ends with d sound you starts with y sound together these two sounds combine and they produce the sound j j what did you say? What did you say? Nice. The sentence is for practice. Did you mull it over? Did you mull it over? Nice. Did you do it yourself? Did you do it yourself? Mm -hmm. Would you like to be able to speak English fluently? Would you like? Would you like? Uh -huh. And could you help me? Could you help me? Now it's your turn. Great. Now let's take a look at the following words. Last year. Or the title, have a met your mother. Both words, last as well as met, end with the sound T. T. Last. Met. And the following word, your, your, starts with the sound Y. Together, T sound as well as Y sound combine and they produce the sound CH. For example, last year, last year, how I met your mother, how I met your mother. Sentences for practice. Can't you see, can't you see, eat your dinner, eat your dinner. Shut your eyes, shut your eyes. Cut your hair, cut your hair. Bodacious. Also, as I said previously, the sound S mingles with the sound Y. Together, they combine the sound SAH. SHH. Uh, to be more specific, CH. For example, we do say, I missed you a lot, I missed you a lot. I hope you pass your driving test. I hope you pass your driving test. Great. And also, let me tell you about the amalgam of Z sound as well as Y sound. Together, these two sounds produce the sound J. For example, we do say 
Those, yes. Those, yes. Can you say that? Mm hmm. Say this is for practice. Because you did, because you did. That's right. She's your wife. She's your wife. Mm hmm. He's your brother. He's your brother. Nice. However, please keep in mind when we have other consonant which follows um, this Z sound, for example, A, we are not supposed to produce the sound Z. For instance, he's a liar, we still have Z sound. We do not say he's a liar. No, 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 no. In case you didn't know, in case you didn't know, YouTube, YouTube. As you can tell from the title, as you can tell from the title, today is your chance, today is your chance. Great, nice to meet you, nice to meet you. It makes you wonder, it makes you wonder. Can I get you anything? Can I get you anything? I bet you both doesn't know. I bet you both doesn't know. Is your brother arriving by plane tonight? Is your brother arriving by plane tonight? How is your family doing since you had accident? How is your family doing since you had accident? Would you like to have lunch with us? Would you like to have lunch with us? See you, Pep. Having learned a few basic ideas about assimilation, we are supposed to keep more word. And another idea that I really want to introduce to you today is going to be the following. Long as well as short vowels in the English language. You might know that there are five basic um, long vowels in the English language. For example, a, o, u, e, as well as e. Keep in mind, however, when the letter i is in the middle of two consonants, you're supposed to pronounce this sound as a short uh, sound. So therefore, you cannot say little. No, 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 no. It doesn't work that way. Little, little. Keep in mind that a sound is going to be really short in its nature, as well as it is deep inside your throat. And also, I would say, when you just trying to produce this I sound, it, you might even say a, something between e as well as schwa sound. A, a. For example, ship, ship, lip, thin, fill. Please keep in mind, we have some exceptions. For example, such words as uh, built as well as quit should be produced with a sharp sound, very short sound. Wheel, feel, team, peace, people, believe, sheet, leave. Sick, seek, feel, feel, but, bead, still, steal, read, read. Read is a great word to describe impressionable person who is a weak uh, person as well. So, for instance, the jurors were mere reeds in the wind. Reeds in the wind. Can you say that? Great! Thank you for having allocated your time watching this video. I hope you do find it enjoyable and I do hope that you have learned something. Brilliant day and...